Hello everybody and welcome. We're on the way to the Ham Fest this morning. That's the Dayton Hamvention. And uh, we're headed to Xenia, Ohio, which is east of uh, where we're staying in uh, South Dayton. And uh, looking good. Typical uh, rain this morning, lightning, thunder, but it all moved east, so it shouldn't be too bad. I suspect that we'll probably have uh, um, maybe some intermittent showers this afternoon, uh, but we'll see how that all goes. We're seeing more and more Teslas everywhere. I've got a red Model Y right in front of us that makes double Y. Y. It's coming into Xenia, Ohio here now, and uh, it looks like it's uh, Auto Row along uh, Interstate 35, which is now turned to surface streets. Xenia was uh, wiped off the map with a Category 5 tornado a number of years ago, and they had to rebuild the entire place. So a lot of stuff is new here. Hello, everybody. Yeah, look at this. This is what happens when uh, we have a bunch of... Uh, of rain here at the flea market space. Yep. And it gets worse. If it rains anymore, it just is terrible. This is uh, the flea market. Where people bring all kinds of goodies out here. So, should be interesting. So normally you see these kinds of radios and they've been in a fire. Look at this guy. Oh man, and you think, no, no, the whole house burned down, right? Well, the fact is, is the gentleman that owned this smoked cigars. And uh, this is what you find when you smoke cigars uh, for how many million years? 83. 83 years. Wow. He lived to be 84. 84. He lived till 84, and uh, apparently he died of lung cancer. So there you go. All right, if you know what this is, you know. I'm here at the Hamvention in Dayton, Ohio, actually Xenia, Ohio, and I've met Mike. Mike is uh, here, and I found out that Mike's actually driven all the way from Arizona in this Model 3. Mike, how was your trip? Did you have a great time or what? Oh, wonderful trip. Uh, just under 2,000 miles to get here. And uh, very, uh, very easy trip. Uh, the car ran flawlessly. The uh, supercharging was easy. And uh, especially good thing was when I was driving through Oklahoma and experiencing very strong winds, the autopilot just glued the car to the road and kept it in the lane. 
so it took a lot of the workload off the drive. It was a beautiful trip. Excellent. Yeah, I, this car is amazing. Uh, one of the things I found here in Mike's uh, car is the shield here. I've come to find that uh, this is available in the Tesla store. You can buy it, and it fits right up into the glass roof. And one of the benefits, other than uh, it's the sun, is it actually makes it quieter in here. Uh, what do you think? Uh, 3dB more or what? I don't know. I think it would be a fun experiment to run. Oh, yeah. So okay. when you buy hey, one, there you, you go. can uh, run an experiment. Hey, my new feature for my new Y. I'll right. do that. That okay. sounds like a good test. Very good. Well, Mike, it's very nice meeting you in person, and thank you for following the channel. And uh, good luck here in the Hamfest. Now, there is one warning. Don't buy too much stuff and take it home. You're right. supposed to sell the no, stuff. I brought things to sell, so if you'd like to buy a few items. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I don't know how much mm -hmm. stuff I can stick in the Model Y, but uh, I bought a few things already, so you know how it is. Right. You can't not buy stuff exactly. here. Exactly. Good. Well, thank you, and very nice meeting you. We'll Likewise, see you again. Good to meet you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. One additional thing here in Mike's car, he's installed a uh, U and V radio, and uh, it's a really cool thing. He uses a trunk lip mount. We'll take a look at that here in a second, but it uh, allows him to use his ham radio here in the car. It's excellent. So right here is uh, the antenna mount. It's uh, a, a mount purchased off Amazon, and as you can see, it makes it very easy to uh, connect the antenna to the trunk lip. And then uh, you can put on whatever whip you want for whatever bands you're actually working. It's a great idea. It looks like it holds on there very well. I need a record player, see? It was a great day at the Ham Fest. We picked up some goodies. Uh, we're gonna go and do some things tonight. And then tomorrow we're gonna hit it hard again. We met some folks, met Mike, uh, met a bunch of people we knew at the Ham Fest and it was great. If you liked today's video, go ahead and click the like, click subscribe, you know I'd certainly appreciate it. Thanks for watching. I'll see you from the flea market tomorrow and take care.